Yes, welcome back to Why in the Morning or Queen's Wednesday on Why in the Morning. My name is Barry Moses or it's Barry Moore on social media. It's time for Strength of a Woman. I know it's your favorite segment because we get to highlight uh, the queens who are doing amazing stuff uh, for themselves and for the world at large. My guest uh, for today, before I introduce uh, White54 channel on Twitter, White54 underscore channel on Instagram and White54 on Facebook, hashtag is Why in the Morning. Uh, don't forget to tell us where you're watching us from because we appreciate it so much. Uh, so so my guest has done it all from uh, being uh, in the Big Brother Africa house uh, to politics to making gospel music now. She goes by the name Sabina Stadler. Karibu sana. I like the way you introduce the show. I am Bori. You get on a on a Zoom tour, Sani. I'm a Twitter ma queens. I'm a Twitter belege. Sbelege, I'm a Twitter. Hey, hey, hey. Anyway, karibu sana. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. So, uh, sauti mekubali? Ah, sauti kwa saa. Ni, sijui ni baritone pia ama... Eh, ni baritone, ni baritone, ah, ni baritone. Ni mfanya test, the Kusha frequency sisi. kwa exactly at baritone. Ah, with the eh, eh. So, kani me, kuna kitu ni mekosea, kamera yako ni number four, yeah. ni upatia kila mtu chance, aji introduce, aseme, kila kitu kama Professor Magoa. Ah, mm -hmm. sawa. My name is Sabina mm -hmm. Anyango Stadler, mm -hmm. aka Sabina Redeemed. Mm -hmm. On all social media, you can find me as Sabina Redeemed and on YouTube, Pia. Yes, actress, Sabina producer. Sabina Redeemed is your, you're an actor, producer, mm. uh, you're a CS as well. Mm. People don't know that, that you yes. work really closely with the Nairobi women's rep. Yes. Uh, despite the fact that you guys look alike. Yes, <laughs> but you're not related. <laughs> but you're not related. Yeah. But you get that a lot. Yes. All right. So, uh, yes. uh, growing up in Mombasa, mm -hmm. Sindo? Yeah. Naskia, zero, zero, one. Uh, you are quadru ratio. Eh. Una races come on, eh? From German. Eh. The, the other three? Ah, me me sina, it's Tambu Kabila. Me ni Kenya too. Come on, come on, we should not be All right, but uh, like you know, represent. Uh, it represents a lot when you have somebody who's akuna ako diverse. Yes. When somebody is diverse, it mm. represents uh, togetherness. It yes. represents uh, uh, something special. So don't shy away from sharing it. Yes, I don't know if I'm to begin a piano as a funny meru, Baba Yaki, and Meru, Mamma Yaki, and Luya. Pia go diverse. Pointy. Eh, Pia ni pointy. So, tonight is your two evil to sort it. All right, so how was it growing up in Mombasa? Mombasa was nice. Mm -hmm. I love I love Mombasa so much. Like mm -hmm. Nigeza Kurudi Sasa and Vene my station cool any chache. Like mm -hmm. you know, when I look back at Mombasa, first of all, when mm -hmm. I used to go to school, mm -hmm. Panda Gari Moja, mm -hmm. Nairobi, you have to come to town, take another matatu. Uh -huh. You know, I think I enjoyed that part of Mombasa and then mm -hmm. also you don't need money in Mombasa. You don't that need time. that much money in yes. Mombasa. Uh, as in, kama sayi ni mebweka, ata mm. na mtoto wangu, mm -hmm. I would have gone to the beach, uh -huh. tunge swim bure, kunyo madafu. Najua, tule madafu, maybe 20 bob, viazi karai, 20 bob. Yani na 100, mm. niko sorted. Alright. So well, the Nairobi, cost of living in Nairobi is different. Yes, the, even, like if you want to go somewhere, you can't uh -huh. go to the beach, there's no beach. Uh -huh. If you want to go to swim, maybe utalipa 200 na minimum. Na aboreta mpia squeezy tunalipa. Ama 50 bob, ata aboreta munalipa 50 bob, mm -hmm. naona? I think right. it's 50 bob, yeah. I feel you. So, uh, Mombasa is a little bit chill. It's nice, even education is cheaper. Uh -huh. So, yeah, niku uzuri sana, upepo mtamo. All right, on the flip side, what is yeah. good about Nairobi? What do you love about Nairobi? Uh, I love Nairobi, the fast, fast paced life. Uh -huh. Like, you you cannot afford to, to sit down, uh -huh. you know, like somebody else is going to beat you at it. Uh -huh. So, lazima ile kuhaso, like, especially watu wengi waki, waki move to Nairobi, uh -huh. Ningumu sana tena was why why she Mombasa. So mm -hmm. even for me, I just go for a holiday. In fact, I, when I usually go, I'm like, oh my gosh, there's a new building, you know. Uh -huh. But then after Mucheng one week, ni mesha maliza tuwa. Like, okay, moving on. You know? <laughs> moving on. Yeah. All right, uh, first of all, uh, how did you make it to Big Brother? Big Brother, I did auditions. Uh -huh. They usually had auditions that time. And there were like almost six auditions. Mm -hmm. And then the last one. Where were the auditions? Uh, I think they were at Hilton, Hilton, Hilton. Uh -huh. and then the others were in South Africa now when uh -huh. we made the top whatever. All right. Mm. All right. So when you got to Hilton, how, how long was the line? 
uh, I was there early. Uh-huh. I, I remember um, nil, my child was like four months. Nili kwa ni mewachana na mambo ya media, you know, uh-huh. after being pregnant, uh-huh. I, and then I was a single mother already. Uh-huh. So I was like, ah, I'm going to go in a comeback. You know, mean I make comeback. Uh-huh. So I, I was excited because I'd been idle for like one year. Not uh-huh. idle, but not in the picture of media. Uh-huh. So I was like, ah, this is my chance to, to go back and, you know, continue uh-huh. my dream. Because I thought it would be a platform for my talent. So All right. I was there very early. The Did you feel was, any little you know, bit of intimidation when you got no. to the auditions? Did you feel like, ah... Oh, Will I really make it to represent Kenya on this stage? No, because I'd, I'd already tried before and failed it. Uh-huh. So for me, failing again was no problem <laughs> because uh-huh. I'd already known how it is to fail. Uh-huh. So it, it just is like, okay, I'll get it or not. Now life it in the layer too. The same uh-huh. way the other time, siku pata, uh-huh. pia life it in the layer. Mm. So when you finally got the, uh, how was the life? Do you, do you feel like you're too exposed when you're in that house? Big yeah, brothers when, you're, when you are in the Big Brother house, uh-huh. of course there are cameras everywhere. Um, and then for me, I, uh, you know, there's um, at that time I didn't know, but there's like almost. It's not that what one a shower, as you know, when shower naked, uh-huh. it's not the unethical part of it. Exposure. But it's uh-huh. the kuna kitu pale very spiritual uh-huh. that was happening to all the housemates. And I remember for me, I would just sit, and uh-huh. it's like. What one at like Siko, Nico, mm-hmm. but Siko. Uh-huh. And if anyone would notice later, um, Maranyinga will call on Yeshiko camera, mm-hmm. Sana. Many people would say, Mona, where is Sabino? Is Sabino? They would comment. Mm-hmm. And even when they'd ask, who, Which housemate do you want to come back? It, um, I had the highest votes, like mm-hmm. Sabina, um, to come back. So there's something very spiritual. That's why I don't really usually like talking about it. Not because that I'm ashamed of anything. Mm-hmm. I didn't do anything bad there. I was myself. Mm-hmm. And nearly, and actually, because they imagine any kitchen that 20 million ish, it an idea, you know. Uh-huh. I didn't go for anything. And my personality. The talent is what made me win, win mm-hmm. to get to represent. To get Kenya. to represent Kenya. Yeah. So how, we, how, how was the ev- ev- eviction? The ev- eviction, I was, they actually, my eviction was weird because they had already evicted the people. Uh-huh. Then they came back and then they evicted me. Uh-huh. And we were, we were the most uh, loudest people in the house. Three of us, we were evicted the same day. <laughs> but you know, yeah. So <laughs> after that, I think, sure, you were like, hey, you know, right. energy, you know, yeah. So they really suffered a victim event. Yeah, they suffered. <laughs> but I, th- I thank God because, like I said, there were so many spiritual things. It was warfare. I didn't know until I came out. And then I had to pray. I had to fast and pray. And mm-hmm. I had to burn everything that I got from that house mm-hmm. because I was, like, under bondage. All right. My, I would dream bad things. And I was not the only one. It was mm-hmm. from other housemates. Now, you guys had conversations yes, about other this? Yes, with other housemates, thing. yes. And right. I remember I prayed with another housemate from another country. And when we prayed and we did the prayer, Sayo Kulinyesha, immediately Sayo, in, when, when we were burning our things, you know, because mm-hmm. that's what my pastor told me to do. And, you know, you get initiated, you know, they take your blood. Of mm-hmm. course, they tell you they're testing you for this and this. You sign contracts. It's like almost you are doing things you don't know. Mm-hmm. So for me, it was a spiritual warfare. And don't, that's what I was saying. If you can't get a big brother, big brother. They don't amount to anything. If you really are keen, because I saw famous, but I'm famous for showing my ass. That doesn't mean I'm successful. Mm-hmm. So it's it's just something sad. Yeah. Gaetano is doing well. Gaetano is one different person. Like I'm doing well. I can't mm-hmm. say, I'm, but I went for prayers. You All see, right. I I got deliverance from that. So I can't know what Gaetano did or didn't do. All right. But also, I can't. See, you can't really know someone is doing well because they are on TV. That doesn't mean they're doing well. You understand? Factual, factual. <laughs> that, <laughs> you just look. <laughs> kina prezo, factual. Kina, I don't want to name people. Uh-huh. Yeah. Factual. That's fact. Yeah. Would you do it again? No. I have chance. been. I have been given. They wanted to organize an all stars, but I said uh, I'm. I'm not going to do it. And even whenever they do reunions, I don't go for them. There was one in Rwanda. I was going to go thinking it was an album launch for the uh-huh. Rwandese housemates. Uh-huh. They had already like organized passport. I, then on the poster saying BBA reunion, I'm like, I'm out. 
You're not doing this. So yeah, because I don't want to promote it because I know what it did to me. I mm-hmm. I, I can't go so much because this is not a spiritual show. You need to be spiritually mature. Mm-hmm. Hey, mature Jesus. Yes, don't worry. Uh, but uh, in <laughs> yeah. the morning, asha school about Yeah, so boy, I'm going to chat, I'm going to chat. Yeah, so yani yeah, ndio yeah. ndio hivyo. Unajua because so many young people watch this show. So stuck him to because people might ask me, hey, how do I get to Big Brother?" I would just mm-hmm. tell you, "Don't even think about just do there's so many other platforms for people now mm-hmm. si kama hiyo time yetu mm-hmm. unajua kuko na shows mob sasa kuna vitu mingi sana there's instagram as well yeah uh, you don't even need a show you can search your own show and you there's have youtube, youtube as well there's Powerful words. words from sabina right here yeah. white 54 channel on twitter white 54 underscore channel on instagram and white 54 on facebook hashtag is wine morning uh, don't forget to tell us where you're watching us from so we can give you a shout out sabina the last question on big brother yes yes going into the house your kid is like seven months old or six uh, months i think five or six did you get a lot of backlash for this yes i did but for me i understood that i am the sole provider for this child so mm-hmm. yes and right. i didn't leave my child with the neighbor uh-huh. my mother I, i brought my mother she lives in mombasa i brought uh-huh. her uh-huh. to nairobi my sister uh-huh. um they went to stay with my sister uh-huh. at my sister's place uh-huh. so it was my mother my sister um my daughter was staying with them and the house up right. so she was in good hands definitely. she was in good hands definitely mm. how, how is she doing now ah kosawa say ko shule right <laughs> 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 all right uh, so after big brother uh, you say uh, it didn't help you in any way in any bit uh, you touched on that uh, but i'd like to know how do you find yourself uh making gospel music mm. right now from mm. big brother from tv big brother yeah. acting everything to making gospel music where did you find the light and uh, how did how did you know that i think this is my mission in life to to minister through singing mm. i think you know, you know it's just uh, a time god mm-hmm. god chooses a time to call you mm-hmm. and for me i got saved when i was in high school but mm-hmm for me to start walking in the work was later later after even I'd gotten a child mm-hmm. so in that res- retrospect like maybe i wanted to sing but i didn't want to just sing mm-hmm. so i really held that dream off for some time mm-hmm. it's like that thing was burning in me that i have to sing something meaningful mm-hmm. so my first song was a peace song but mm-hmm. sikwa ipeleka anyone niliandika nika record but w- was this in 2017 yes All yes right. it was so then i think deep inside i was not fulfilled like Okay yeah it's a peace song but any you know just as you know but you are confused so until i got the right message i was like okay god so god wants me to sing, sing gospel oh so i asked god okay give me a song to sing then that's why my song also it starts the first line is give me a song to sing give it's me a song called to sing. el shadai produced yes. by produced by uh, that was Vicky Pondis uh-huh. but I never went back to Vicky Pondis I didn't have a good experience there uh-huh. so my producer now is Marshall Music Marshall it's called Marshall Music Pedro is it Pedro Pe- Padre uh-huh. Pedro Pedro <laughs> Nani All right. you know? uh, so uh, you didn't have a good experience with a producer this is not the first time not, I'm hearing yeah, this on 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 this show <laughs> yes. especially from a queen like you the name of the <laughs> oh, the so name of the show nice. is <laughs> producer <laughs> it's crazy hey, meweza so nikikosa kusema oh mwaka unga ah lucky when kwasha za feel special but yeah. still it could be a double edge it could <laughs> yes. be double edge yes uh, but anyway uh, so what what is this experience that you had my experience was unajua watu ni tofauti um see kwamba at he's a bad producer is just not fit for me Uh-huh. Yes because All like right. my producer now Marshall is very patient with uh-huh. me. Uh, I believe na your producer wengi waki make it wa like ile ukisikia sana nyimbo uko na wasanika 10 uh-huh. wamekuja ku record kwako. Uh-huh. It's very hard for you to give that attention. Uh-huh. But me I usually like someone no no like my my first job I was a waitress at Nando's. Uh-huh. But ninge ku service on my chicken uh-huh. unarudi. Yani I serve you with all my heart, uh-huh. you know. Hata kama ni kufagia fagia na with all your heart you uh-huh. see so the fact that for me i've paid my money and then uh-huh. you treat me like i'm not a worthy customer uh-huh. because maybe ndio nyimbo yangu ya kwanza i'm like okay do say and then na wale master mabigi uh-huh. bigi so right. kuna mtu anaweza kuwa akona experience poor uh-huh. na na huyo producer it doesn't mean he's a bad producer uh-huh. just for me 
hatukuendana uh-huh. ethics zetu ni tofauti Some so people mm, just don't mix yeah so right. for me hata um, kama ni msanii mpya nitamwambia usiende sana kwa wao producer wakubwa because mm-hmm. sasa ni wanasumbua usije wakanipatia ka backlash uh-huh. <laughs> lakini naona wanaweza kusumbua mtu anakanya nyimbo yako one month because uh-huh. there are so many artists uh-huh. to prioritize si uh-huh. makosa yake si artist kumi utamaster nyimbo saa ngapi uh-huh. you know and it's a good thing that they are making those jobs but mungu akikuweka pia juu usidharau wale watu wanaanza so mm-hmm. for me my producer i find, i like marshall because he's patient with me kama mm-hmm. kuna kitu sijafurahia tuna meet katikati right. aseme me i think hii tungeifanya hivi alafu naambia mimi i think tufanye hivi which one do you think yeah so i like that about him and he's patient and he will give me my song within the week niko na song yangu mastered all right on the flip side yeah. you're a producer when it comes to the world of uh, film and tv yes sindo Ah, uh, is on makosa umetolea producers wa yes. muziki. Do you yeah. see them in yourself when it comes to TV? No, because I'm uh, uh, you see the difference with me nimekuwa actress mwanzo uh-huh. na nikakuwa sasa producer. So uh-huh. akuna venye naweza ongelesha mtu vibaya because najua I've been there. Takama anachoma picha. Ah uh, no, I just correct you because you see the good thing you is I'm a Christian. You are on number 20. <laughs> uh-uh. I'm a Christian I have to my you see my job is also my my ministry. Uh-huh. Siezi enda pale ni kuongelesha vibaya ati na mini gospel artist. It's uh-huh. we are one entity. Sabina ni yule yule mmoja. Uh-huh. So I have to show you the love of Christ. There was thing you can do is come to the set drunk mm-hmm. not even hangover drunk because mm-hmm. we kunywa so hapo nitaona you see i'll just talk to you like this this is how i'd say it you see we uko job kuna mm-hmm. actors wengine say hawa ko job it would be good if you you appreciate this honor that mm-hmm. umepata sasa hivi uko on air mm-hmm. usikuje drunk and mm-hmm. this is if because if you do unajua kwa show tunakuanga tu mm-hmm. so si ati uweze kufa unaweza kukuiwa kwa show <laughs> so ni wewe utajichomea yeah it's just to correct Future because people make mistakes out there don't show up to sabena's <laughs> drunk hangover at least yes. <laughs> <laughs> at least you know is pay ga ha uh you're working really closely uh with the, the Nairobi women's rap yeah uh, i was at uh Uh, at exhibition at yes. exhibition kule railways mm. museum mm. yes and uh, for a moment cameras kanza kufuata wakidhani wao ndio eh. Nairobi women's rep eh. ah wakakumbuka ah jamani eh. ah, ah, what makubwa. are you doing with the Nairobi women's rep um women rep mimi tulikuwa nae tangu campaign uh, uh-huh. in 2017 I, i used to be on her campaign team uh-huh. i was uh, very close to her and i supported her vision mimi nilikuwa nataka tu yashinde because of how on our own personal conversation najua mtu mwingine akimwona mimi naweza kuwa na opinion yake but for me usually i say kitu ya kwanza aliniuliza i wanted to join her team I I know Lisa what do you want God to do for you through you working for me mm-hmm. what is it she didn't ask me what do you want me to do for you if mm-hmm. I get the seat you know mm-hmm. or whatever so I was like oh this woman is so wise you know mm-hmm. and she took us she told me everything I do I ask God first mm-hmm. you know even when I I want to pick food from my fridge mm-hmm. what am I eating today God chicken or fish mm-hmm. you know so I was like it's this somebody, deep, mm. so because it's it, even it's something simple like if I come out from here KBC mm-hmm. uh white 54 I I will ask God which road do I take because everything has a purpose uh-huh. sahi nikienda na Koinange street na nikienda na Moy avenue there's a purpose maybe somebody i was to meet on my avenue would do something for me or you know uh-huh. or i would do something for them but because i go now Koinange street i will uh-huh. have missed that maybe it will be a destiny helper and that will affect the whole of my life because one step kama sasa sasa hii singewahi show yangu ya kwanza ilikuwa KBC na ilianza because i went to the wrong audition uh-huh. i kulikuwa na audition mbili place moja nikaenda the wrong audition uh-huh. hey, na shindwa hii ni role gani tena i thought anyway so nikifanya audition huo msikupata hata hiyo audition uh-huh. But wewe mtoka anambia kuna show nyingine have in mind for you KBC inaitwa The Tassel. Mm-hmm. So kama singefanya hiyo show ya KBC, kama singefanya the singe na the other place, mm-hmm. it looked like a mistake but it wasn't because there's a purpose. And mm-hmm. if it was not that show in KBC, singekuwa penye niko because mm-hmm. that's what led me to the media side of life. So everything happens yes. for a reason. Yes. Before we get to what you we get back to what you're doing with Passeries. Have you always been like this? The spiritual where you believe everything is interconnected and uh, there's a supreme being above us. Yeah. Uh, have you always been the spiritual? Of course sikuwa na wisdom hiyo ya kujua everything uh-huh. is connected because hata sahi sahi unikiimagine ati kuna mtu aliniwacha maybe chali aliniwacha I'm like oh it was so that I can't. Ni umeachwa. Nimeshawacha imagine. Ai ai. 
but it is because i knew what i was worth not so many mini limwacha actually mm-hmm. it's just because when you know what you are worth mm-hmm. you you can't take some things so i uh, yeah i believe in every even rejection it has a purpose mm-hmm. every delay kuna mm-hmm. pingine hata hata maybe station fulani linikata you know it's i've been rejected not just by a man but even by jobs uh-huh. by auditions by uh-huh. many other things by uh-huh. friends you know so in the long run everything has a everything has, as long as umeeka mungu mbele mungu mbele yes because kuna zingine sasa wewe umeenda tu kivi yako ki freestyle of course kuna vitu stand tu mrama yeah but of course god has always been in the picture for me uh-huh. it's just that ile wisdom inakuja the more yeah the more you spend time with god mm. <laughs> all right back to what you're doing at the office of the nairobi women yeah uh-huh. So yeah so um when we met during the campaign akana mbevo I prayed about it because I'm hey this is somebody I want to support ata mm-hmm. yani I don't want anything from her I just mm-hmm. want to support her so kwa sababu most politician wakishaingia ndo hizo story you maisha unaona so and I know I knew for women rep pesa yao unajua ni a group yani hakuna opportunity so si ati alikuwa anasema my governor and same thing tapewa position job mm-hmm. you know mm-hmm. so uh, I just wanted to support her but w- when uh, we got the seat eh uh, sasa ndio nikakuwa CS wa arts and culture because uh-huh. you see that's something i know naweza simamia wasanii because mimi mwenyewe najua shida za wasanii mm. so it was how actually put me in that docket not that uh-huh. i asked for it so because she saw uh, uyu atakuwa poa hapa kufanya hivyo uh-huh. so yeah so the kuna ministries are health coffee here to business whatever uh-huh. so i had arts and culture in the whole of nairobi but i also had langata mm-hmm. and makadara constituencies mm-hmm. so i'm a sectional head also a sectional yeah. head as well yes. but you had uh, arts and culture across mm. all right uh how many like ministries do you guys have the i think there are about Roughly. eight because about you see eight. we are 17 sectional heads uh-huh. so uh kuna like wale wa sasa wana wanafanya hizo ministry because mm-hmm. kama mimi arts culture and sports but there's also one who heads sports uh-huh. alone All right. but me also i help her in sports but mm-hmm. my my main thing is arts and culture arts and culture so tuko kama wawili wawili kwa moja i mm-hmm. feel that uh, so you guys coordinate and work together yeah on a day to day yes there's someone who handles pwds mm-hmm. yeye anajua watu wengi watu wa disability kuna mwingine anafanya sana mambo ya health mm-hmm. mwingine atafanya mambo ya entrepreneurship mm-hmm. water sanitation mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. i've seen you on the ground really active at the art exhibition mm. uh, what are some of the projects uh, under your docket so we no. have a mobile film competition coming mm-hmm. during the end of the year So stay tuned when you follow to mtapata info mobile film mobile film competition mm-hmm. so it's a it's a film competition where you just record it with your mobile phone mm-hmm. yeah so the theme for that will be based on the sdgs uh-huh. uh, sustainable development goals mm-hmm. which are gender poverty you know zero hunger zero i una zijua food desert hey king king i'm part of the queen leo cheza chini cheza <laughs> so, Daivo, so we want you to make a film based on those things mm-hmm. like things that empower that talk about poverty, how can mm-hmm. we end poverty, gender equality, employment for mm-hmm. youth. Yeah, and then kutakuwa of course na prize money, mm-hmm. kutakuwa na mentorship certification. And then also for we have a a project where the, it's the 50-50 project mm-hmm. where like you see most of the guys who work kutoka shule film school ukija ku apply pale wanakuambia do you have experience mm-hmm. do you sasa utapata je experience kama una upewe hiyo opportunity experience mm-hmm. so for the 50-50 project we say 50% of uh, let's say for uh, if i have a show mm-hmm. 50% of the crew will be um, professionals mm-hmm. the other 50 will be uh, in it nini wanakuwa shadowed mm-hmm. amateurs mm-hmm. wale wametoka shule mm-hmm. and then also the other 50 will be women so mm-hmm. we are empowering women but you're also empowering the the ones who don't have experience mm-hmm. to gain experience in the law right? and be paid also and be paid in the process yeah. there's money going around mm. see exposure to na kuna watu nyingi eh, yeah. and also we usually welcome your proposals mm-hmm. like we we have plays we go for plays people mm-hmm. invite us for plays mwishimwa usually we give money from our office mm-hmm. um a music we have a music video competition because many people wana tuambianga eh hey, tunakuwa na audio tunataka shoot video mm-hmm. with no money to shoot the video mm-hmm. So we we have a competition which will be coming for uh shooting your music videos for 
you Aye. for artists yeah and then so much more but like i said you can apply to you can apply for as well. funding for your own how thing. do we keep tabs with what's going on at the office of the mm. nairobi women's rap you can follow esther pasaris mm -hmm. uh at, especially she's very active on twitter mm -hmm. you'll get a lot of information there and also um our office is at KCC 15th floor. It's mm -hmm. always open to people to walk in and out. Just mm -hmm. carry your ID, you're always a Kupita. And not so, only queens. Yeah, no, no, my kings, Pia, my, my kings, princess, Pia. princesses. My prince. <laughs> <laughs> really, yeah. All right. Uh, so uh, back to the music. Yes. <laughs> Since this is your core business now. Yeah. All right. Uh, are we looking to see any albums in future, collaborations? What are we yes, uh, uh, to expect when it comes to the music side of Sabrina? So I have a co new collab, it's like two weeks old with mm. Ecodida's kids, keep mm -hmm. it real and I'm blessed. Uh -huh. Because now I've gone to the hip hop trap, rap. All right, because all right. It's also, I'm going, I also have a dancehall song, so it's mm. not just hip hop trap, but uh -huh. it's more like rap. I'm all not right. going to be rapping, not singing anymore. Uh -huh. So yeah, so that's a new, I've rebranded. So uh -huh. even my artist name now is Sabina Redeemed, uh -huh. where by before it was just Sabina, uh -huh. now it's Sabina Redeemed. And I have a collab coming uh, with somebody who I can't say mm -hmm. his name yet, but he used to be a sick rapper, Kitambo Secular, mm -hmm. and then he got saved. All right. Do you have an idea who that is? Mm -hmm. huh. I have Ebu, a list. Ebu, Ebu send us who you think. Is. <laughs> take a guess. All right, take a guess on our Facebook page right there. And don't forget, there's a question on Facebook as well that you need to address. But send us uh, that guess of yours. I have my own. Yeah. Used to be a sick rapper. Yes. A capona. Uh huh. Now he's doing gospel music. Uh, I hmm. said he, he got saved. I didn't say he, he does. <laughs> All right, he got saved. <laughs> this. Alright, I need to leak it to the viewers. Just tell us what you think uh, or who you think that could be. Yes. There's a there's a picture of Sabrina on our Facebook page and a poke comment. Kitwambia who you think the collab might be with. Yes. Keep it real. Na... I'm blessed. I'm blessed. You know those are their real names. Yes, yes, yes. They've been here before. Yes. Ekodida is doing amazing stuff. I even like uh, the way he thinks. It's, it's really oh, progressive. Yes, yes. It's really Absolutely. a progressive gentleman. Uh, studio session will watch. Ah, studio will watch. Poor son and they are on time. Uh -huh. Uh, well, I'm like, well, so excited. All right. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, and then, of course, we'll put our kill patel. But you're good with kids, obviously. I bet. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. To look up for. Mungu ali tupetu your grace. All right. Yeah. How can they find the song? The song is on YouTube. It's mm -hmm. Just talk to them. Rende. Look them straight into their eyes. Nikona, 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 Nikona. Rende. Tuko church. Tuko kibao. Tuko rende. Kuta tu keti di kupe testimony matuti na makeki. Yes, that's the line. Come on, da kuskia more of that. Up on YouTube. Straight to YouTube. Uh, which YouTube channel? It's on Ecodida's channel, uh -huh. but please also subscribe to uh -huh. mine. Uh -huh. Yes, because to Leona, you are Nimbo, was an easy one. I do not take any channel, but you see, Nimbo, you are Nimbo to get a channel, you are in a longer time because Ecodida is a bigger artist. It's even an honor for him to let me put the song on his channel, uh -huh. you know. And Atam Sani Mugine Sayim Kubu Atak Bali. So, so you have to be visionary. Yeah, when it so comes this, to this. Uh -huh. that's good for the song. Uh -huh. Ecodida's channel has. A hundred times subscribers than mine, uh -huh. so the song will move faster and reach more people. And for me, it's about the ministry. Mm -hmm. I want people to hear the song so that they hear from God. So it's not about that. Because Wonderful. even the song is written Sabina featuring the kids. It's, uh -huh. it's my song, but we always see it as our song because if it wasn't with them, it would be a different thing. Uh -huh. So it would of be a course, different they all bring something. Yeah. It would be a different reach altogether. Your uh, last. Message your ah, last, last message. Missy uh Andy, -huh. I'm not going. I was in the round in the episode. Mr. Producer, there's nothing I can do. We have to stay. I am on strike. <laughs> we have to stay. I'm a queen. The show ends with Sabina today, <laughs> so we can go on and yeah. on and on. So, I could have last message. I uh, could last message. I'm still here. What to cut what to Maybe tomorrow, even I'll come again. <laughs> what to cut what to Okay, I'll send you a message too in case <laughs> the others, you know, and as I cut out, so as I don't get airtime. So, Mm -hmm. My last message is um, start, just start. Whatever it is you're supposed to start, mm -hmm. do it today. You know what I'm talking about. There's something in your heart. Mm -hmm. God has said you should do it. Just don't worry. Even mm -hmm. for me, it's so many things. I was like, oh my God, I remember my first cooking show. I don't have money. How will I shoot a season? But I did it. Start, just start today. And if I didn't start with that small thing, today I wouldn't be here having short films for Mnet, for I don't know, you know, mm -hmm. all those shows. Yeah, check out Rende. 
subscribe to my channel, like, follow, share, tweet, everything. You heard it straight from her, <laughs> Savannah. Uh, she's doing amazing stuff for herself and for the people of Nairobi. Yes, that is a video right there. That is a sample of the video. Wow. And they better put Rende. Hey, <laughs> talking about money on a Rende This is my old song before I started rapping. Uh huh. Yep. All right. You've seen it. Get straight to our YouTube channel as well. Like, subscribe, share. <laughs> if you're going to be playing your music in a few, Kalamival is coming up next with Girls Talk. Uh, don't go nowhere. Don't touch that out.